Hi, I'm Skyler. If you'd like to delete your purchases from your iPod, there are a couple different ways you could do it. Uh, let's go over several of them. So here I am on my home screen, and let's say I want to delete one of these applications. Um, Sound Prism, I never use that. Rest your finger on it until it starts to wiggle, and then tap the black X. Poof, tap delete, and it's gone. So that's one way to delete a purchase. You can also go to settings, and delete things from here too. Check this out. Go to general, then tap usage, and you can see all of your storage. So right now it's assessing everything that I've got stored on my iPhone, and it'll load up in a second with a complete digest of all of that. Okay, we can see that I've got nine gigabytes of photos. I should probably offload those. Filmic Pro is taking up some space. This is a game called Year Walk. These are all purchases. If I tap show all apps, I can tap on one of these and then tap delete app in order to remove it. So that's one easy way to delete purchases. Let's also take a look at music. This is another place where purchases might be stored. So the world is a battlefield. See that's taking up 128 megabytes. If I swipe to the right across it, I can delete it. That's one easy way to delete purchases from iPhone. Also, if you want to sign out of your iTunes account, go back to settings, and then tap iTunes and App Stores, tap your Apple ID, and tap sign out. I'm Skyler. Thanks for watching.